Baller Nation, it's Carmen Roxana, and we're back with more Baller Alert news. But before we get started, make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe to this channel to stay up on the latest in entertainment news and more. Congratulations are in order for Raymond Santana of the Exonerated Five after proposing to reality star and model Delicious, and nothing but love is in the air. On Thursday, the couple both shared the proposal video. Uh-oh. Don't oh, act like yeah. you won this weight loss contest. I said it. Uh, <laughs> you got him, girl. You got him, girl. Look at that diamond. Look at the diamond. With Santana captioning his Instagram post, yeah, it's official. You can really hate me now. Delicious is officially off the market. She's all mine. With the hashtag, God gave me the go ahead. Then Friday morning, Delicious wrote on her Instagram story, woke up different, God loves me, and so does Mr. Santana, alongside an engagement ring emoji. Now, Raymond is one of the members of the Exonerated Five, formerly known as the Central Park Five, along with Kevin Richardson, Antron McRae, Yusuf Salam, and Corey Wise. The men were accused of raping a white woman in New York's Central Park in 1989 and were wrongfully convicted and served sentences. All five of the men were thankfully exonerated in 2002. Delicious, whose real name is Chandra Davis, won the second season of VH1's Flavor of Love, a dating competition show starring the rapper Flavor Flav, back in 2002. She and Flav subsequently broke up, of course. Raymond and Delicious both have children from previous relationships, so I guess we can call them a modern-day Black Brady Bunch. Congratulations again to the happy couple, and we can't wait to see the wedding pictures. Drop your comments and congratulations below. I'm Carmen Roxana, and until we meet again, thanks for watching Baller Alert News. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. I'm out. Someone somewhere is still discussing the old you because they don't have access to the new you, Jordan reposted, adding facts and the 100 emoji after the quote. Jordan later wrote, not every quote that is posted is a sub or a clapback, and not everything posted is directed towards one person in general. 